Hi, I'm Ashley James from Made in Chelsea and welcome to Fashtags Closet Confessions. So I'm going to show you what's in one of my wardrobes. I have two very small wardrobes. Can't wait to get a walk-in wardrobe. I can only dream. So yeah, let's see what I've got. I went shopping about a couple of months ago and bought some amazing trainers but I haven't actually worn them yet because they look like this. So I saw the colours and I love them and I really like high tops, um, heeled high tops. If you guys know what on earth I can wear these with, please let me know because I can't wear them. I'm not brave enough. So the most expensive item in my wardrobe is this amazing Burberry leather jacket. The only thing is it's not actually mine, it belongs to my friend so I just have to hope that she never asks me for it back. But if you want to know what the most expensive item in my wardrobe that I actually own is, it's my Mulberry Alexa. I was bought it so it's a gift. I just love it, I wear it all the time, it's so classic that you can wear it with any outfit. I love it. My best value item in my wardrobe, you guys might be quite surprised given that I'm on Made in Chelsea. However, it's this top and it's from Asda. I went shopping with my mum when I was a student at Nottingham and I came across this in the clothing section and I just loved it. Um, and yeah, it's about five pounds. I've had it for about three years. I'm usually really good at throwing things away or giving them to my little sister just because I'm not really a hoarder. However, this pair of jeans I've had for about five years. They're from Jack Wills. I just can't throw them away. I actually did demote them to the storage boxes just to try and wean myself off them. But you guys came, so I put them back in the wardrobe, which I'm secretly happy about. They have no top button. They've got such big rips on both of the jeans, they're falling to bits, but you know you have a favourite pair of denim jeans, you just don't want to let them go. The item I purchased most recently, I actually bought yesterday from Lipsy. I bought it actually because of Made in Chelsea, we're starting the next series soon, and it made me smile because of the whole made in Chelsea, chic Mark Francis thing. It is quite nerve wracking that we're starting the series again because you do have to think about what to wear. We don't get any help with the styling. So it means that I end up buying a lot of clothes and then wearing them once and not wanting to wear them on the show again. I think this top may make an appearance. So hashtag, you've seen it first. My favourite designer that's in my wardrobe is Alexander McQueen. I bought this Alexander McQueen dress in tribute to him when he passed away and I wore it to the end of series show um, for season four. The thing I love most about the dress is that it's really nicely fitted. It's got support in the bust area and I just love all the colours and it's a really nice silk material. My biggest wardrobe confession, and don't judge me, it's my I love Justin Bieber t-shirt because I really do love Justin Bieber. And I did actually wear it quite recently because I went to go see him live at the O2 and it was amazing. I actually love him. I'm not shamed. I'm a little bit embarrassed, but I'm not shamed. The item I have in my wardrobe that attracts the most attention isn't actually an item of clothing. It is this vintage suitcase, which I got with my mum while shopping in Camden Market. I really love it and whenever I travel with it, everybody stops me to ask where it's from and how much it was. So it's from Camden Market and I managed to get it for £35 because I'm such a good barterer. It's really hard to decide what my best freebie is because obviously I appreciate anything that I get given. But I'm going to say this helmet because I recently did my CBT, which is a scooter license. And I was given this and I love the color. It's so perfect for the sunny weather and it'll keep me safe. The oldest item I have in my wardrobe is this amazing coat. It keeps me so warm in winter. It's such a lifesaver. It actually belonged to my mum and I love the story behind it because my dad bought it for my mum on their second date and they've been together, I 
think for 30 years, but they're going to kill me because that's probably wrong. But they've been together a long time, so I love the fact that it keeps you warm and it was when they were first in love. So, yeah, I love it. I have a couple of really unusual items in my wardrobe. So they're not actually for me, they're for my future daughter. My best friend is so desperate to make sure she's godmother that whenever she travels or goes on holiday she gets me a little dress. So this one's from Madagascar and this one's from Bolivia. They're so cute. I was really lucky that when I was 20 I lived in Paris for a year to do a fashion internship and learn French and right next to my house was the most amazing vintage shop where everything was five euros. So my favourite vintage purchase has to be this belt which is from the Marais vintage shop and it was five euros, it's got Moroccan coins all over it and I love it because it can make a really simple outfit, just have a little unique edge to it. I really hope that I'd never ever be in a house fire and I don't have house insurance at the moment so I probably need to sort that out after this. But if I had to save one item in my wardrobe, I would actually save this hoodie and I know it's not the most amazing item of clothing, it's just got so many memories from my school days. I was so lucky and I went to an amazing school in the Lake District and I made some amazing friends and made some mistakes and yeah, it was my teenage memories so I'd probably save this hoodie and it would keep me warm outside whilst I waited for the fireman. I think you can tell a lot about someone from the secrets they have in their wardrobe so I hope you've learned a little bit about me. Let me know what you like or don't like in the comments below and subscribe to Fashtag. Thanks guys. Maybe <laughs> if I meet Justin Bieber. Actually no, because I wouldn't be a groupie. But it would be a nice idea to have little Biebers in my dresses. But no, I'd like to keep the love platonic. Um, but yeah, my secret little confession in my wardrobe.